Hello and welcome back to Persona 4 Golden. So, we need to go and speak to everybody as they'll all have new dialogue because we have rescued Nanako. Well, maybe, if she comes out of hospital, which we hope she will. Hello. Some politicians visited in elementary school. Oh, we don't have new dialogue. But you know what you have? A charmed veil. It's amazing, I feel different just having this veil near me. Oh, but if I put it on, suddenly I'll stand out and everyone will look at me like I'm crazy. Oh, no! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just thinking about myself again. Please, take this. Five chest keys. Thank you very much. And no new quests. Okay. We have some more quests to hand in. I believe we finished them all, but I can't remember where the other quests were handed out. So we are going to have to do a little bit of a run. I know that one of them... We need to go and sell stuff to Diadara to get. But we are definitely going to do that anyway. I just want to check everywhere before we do that. And that is for the one in Okina. We can't... Yeah, we could still spend time with Chie. We just won't get anything for it because we're maxed out. Okay. I was just looking at Chie there thinking we can't spend time with her, can we? Oh, we should spend time with Naoto today to unlock the social link. Definitely. That seems like a good plan. Right, uh, this way? Just doing a quick sweep. There's definitely- I think there were three quests, which means that once we find this next quest, which actually I think might have been in near the riverbank, but I'm just double checking while we're here anyway. Yeah, once we get that one, we should be good to just go sell stuff. Um, Naoto, we don't need to get any specific persona for Naoto, because we don't have a social link yet. But I believe the social link trigger is that white card that we got, so we can go and try that. Anyway, this way? Anything? Uh, no, we need higher understanding, which we also need to do a tutor job. Understanding, I think, is the next one I want to try out. The tutor job sounds interesting, but I guess that you can only do it... I guess the idea is that you would rush to that job if you were going to do it. Yeah, leave Juness. We don't need to be here. I'm just here to uh, check it out. I think it's in the floodplain. Let's have a look here. Ah, yes, it's the girl with the uh, headband. That'll be it. Apparently, we needed the guardian for something else, but yeah, there you go. Um, oh, it's the branch headband. I knew it would come through. If I wear this, people will be able to tell us apart. It's something unique for me. I'm so happy. You don't know how much this means to me. Uh, um, please take this. We got uh, the bead in a uh, cute bag. All right, cool. We'll leave here. We can now go back to the shopping district, sell our stuff, and then head to Okina. Let's go. Oh, you have a new quest now. We have to prepare to move, so my mother told me to return home quickly today. I'm looking forward to a new place, but it's gonna be kind of lonely. That's why I really don't want to go home right now. Uh, um, I have something to ask you. I'll listen. A while ago, a friend told me I didn't resemble my sister that much. But that's not true. We're so alike that we're capable of telepathy. That's why I said. Bef uh, that's why I said I'll prove them wrong before I move. This is the last time I'll do it. So, will you help me with the telepathy experiment again? Okay. Thank you so much. I'll start s uh, sending someone to my sister now. How's that? Do you think she got it? Go ask. Go ask. All right. We will go ask her sister. Because we know where her sister is, because we literally just finished talking to her about two seconds ago. Hello. Uh, are you here because of my sister and her telepathy stuff again? I don't hear or sense anything, but that's probably obvious to you. Um, can you tell her something for me? Tell her that it's not something we should be able to do because the two of us are different. Also tell her that I don't want her to keep making you do this sort of thing for her. I'm sorry to make you run back and forth like this. Okay, well, go into town. Central shopping district. Let's have a chat. No way, I was sure she would get it this time. She doesn't seem satisfied. Maybe you should visit the other sister once more. Okay, I'll visit the other sister once more. That's fine. Back down here. Um, what? My sister is still trying to test that telepathy thing? She doesn't listen to what people say. I guess that's just how she is. You probably need to sound really convincing or else she won't listen. 
I don't think she'll listen to me, so could you do it, please? I probably need to have an expression level of at least uh, max, which I do, so let's try it. Hello there, sister. Yeah, I know. Deep down, I probably knew the entire time. Thank you. I'm sorry for making you run back and forth. Uh, here. These are for you. Three supersonics. Cool. I'll talk to my sister properly from now on. Thanks again. Um, yeah, let's... I just want to check our quests again. So, 15 we don't have yet. Cat food is just find more fish. Find me something to wear. Yes, that's the one we're currently doing. Find my pet, we're also doing. So we have these quests at the end, but yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, that, I almost walked right past here. Uh, let's sell. Yep. We don't get very much for it, but... Black sheet. We get a uh, Castilla knife. Power rocks, there we go. Invincible mini, that's what we're after. Black grains. Hurricane Coat, Hard Thorn, Guard Rosary. Okay. Castilla Knife is the highest one that we got. Okay, three Endurance. Um, Armor-wise, got the Hurricane Coat. Reduce Wind Damage. Okay, I mean, it's fine. We got some other ones in here as well that I guess I just didn't look at before. That's fine. We've looked at them now. Um, but with the Invincible Mini, it's actually quite good. However, we don't really- we want to buy it, right? But we don't want to equip it. Because it's not for Chie. We're now out of money as well, in case you were wondering. Or couldn't do that calculation yourself. <laughs> uh, Okina. Also, maybe we're gonna have the new thing at the, uh... Maybe we're gonna have the new thing here unlocked? King Frost doll. Oh yeah, let's go. We have enough to uh, burn. We do have a bunch of accessories I'm never gonna use, which we can probably sell if we really run out of money. Ice cube. Okay. We aren't able to get anything. Let's keep going. And... Let's try again. I'm about to run out of money. Please, another two attempts. Okay, that's fine. Hello. Here's the Invincible Mini. Oh, how wonderful. Yes, this is what it was like. Risqué and a little dangerous. Oh, how I shined back then. Thank you, because of you I can go on. I do everything now for my husband and my children. I am only a faithful country wife these days, and that's okay. I'll give this to you. I don't need it anymore. The disco fan. Okay, so is the disco fan any good? Did all this? It doesn't give me 50 SP. So, no. Uh, from, like, yeah, no. Not for what I use Yukiko for. I use her for healing. Although we're getting better healing items, so maybe I do need to switch her over, but still. Right, back to Yasagami. Kind of think. Nobody else is going to give us any money for anything. Hey, Naoto. Oh, Alpac san. Um, th thank you for saving me. I. I want to apologize, but I have something I want to think about. Naoto seems absorbed in thoughts about something. You don't have enough courage to ask her out. Wait, okay, I guess I need the courage as well as the item I have? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll spend time with Yukiko then. Yeah, hello. I wish we could visit Nanako-chan. But all we can do now is wait. But we can wait together. So, uh, do you want to go somewhere? Yukiko was being friendly. Since we have, a, we have a persona that matches, we're going to become closer? Of course. What's our rank, anyway? Seven. Don't do this. Yeah, don't show me all the personas. Right. Let's spend time with Yukiko. Yes. Yukiko looks happy. Tatsumi Shrine. 
Yukiko seems embarrassed for some reason. Um. Um. Uh, do you remember, uh, Kasai-san, the waitress? She seems to have told everyone about you. Now they're saying I sh should bring you home. Adults are so quick to poke fun at me. It's such a hassle, isn't it? But uh, of course my family runs an inn, so guests come by all the time. Maybe next time you can just come in. Oh, Yuki-chan. Oh, the deputy mayor. The people at the inn seemed very busy. Is something going on? Oh no, today was the interview for the travel show. On TV? That's great. You'll try and make Inaba look inviting, won't you? I'm sorry! I have to go! An interview? Uh-huh, it's for a travel show. It looks like a serious show, and we agreed to it because my mother and I won't be filmed. But they need me to help clean, so I have to go now. Yukiko looks apologetic. Goodbye! There you are, Yuki-chan! Kasai-san, what's wrong? The TV crew came in, but don't go to the inn. It was a trick. It's those people from that News of the Weird show. And I think they're looking for you, so stay put, you got that? Huh? Uh, okay, but... There you are. <laughs> no use in hiding, future manager of the Cursed Inn. C cursed Inn? We know all about that murder case. Mayumi Yamano stayed at your place, right? And you guys have been hurting what with the drop in visitors, huh? So I came up with a great idea. The high school manager's embarrassing struggle renovating the cursed inn. How does that grab you? The customers will be pouring in, I tell you. I, I don't understand what you... I want you to be the star. When we introduce the hot springs, let us film a little bathing scene, eh? The modest manager's steamy service. Our ratings will be through the roof. That sounds like a great idea. Listen, you. Anyway, please leave. We are not interested in your coverage. You're refusing? Ah, uh, look, kid. You don't know the power of television, do you? Ironic. Well, I can't blame you. Living in the countryside. We're trying to help you out here. I mean, do you want the patrons to dry up? If you're gonna be the next manager, I'm trusting you to make the right decision here. I won't be the next manager. Oh, really? Hmm, that's so. Well, you just say the word and I can hook you up with a, beat of a better gig than running this dump of an inn. You could call yourself the former high school innkeeper. <laughs> I'm already liking the sound of that. Why don't you hear me out? How dare you say that to Yuki-chan! It's okay, let him say what he wants. He'll go home once he gets it all out. What the shit? You say your inn has been going for generations? But all that means is, it's crappy and run down. Tradition is so last year. You'd be better off if you did close up shop. I've seen the stuff you serve. Small portions, decent service, nothing that stands out. If you want customers, you can't just do the same old, same old. You guys don't get that, and that's why you suck. 
Your waitresses don't even give any extra service unless you tip them, huh? Hey, I know. Why don't you make all the waitresses young girls and have them do all day menus? You know, spread the futon out, then go straight in. But anyways, as I was saying, let's give your place a little TV style publicity. Use your head, will ya? Uh... The hell up! Don't you say another word about our inn. Who take your stupid ideas seriously? From now on, we refuse any coverage from your station. You bitch. If that's how you want to play it, I'll plaster those words all over primetime. See how that feels. Go ahead, by all means. And we'll respond with an official complaint to your sponsors. Uh, th this isn't sounding good, sir. Huh. <sighs> I said some incredible things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should contact the inn. I'll, I'll see you later. I just kind of lost it when he was insulting everyone. W was I scary? You were cool. Really? Thank goodness. Yukiko seems relieved. Uh... There was a time not long ago when I thought it'd be better off if it closed. But it's like my home. It's where everyone in my world is. I can't let it close. Seems Yukiko is starting to face her true feelings. You feel your relationship with Yukiko has grown yet deeper. Fantastic. So is she going to decide to stay at the inn? That would seem like an unsatisfying end. I'm hoping that it resolves well. And we got a new thing here. We got Mudon. Oh good. A spell we can instantly forget. Well that was easy enough. Just a little longer. My heart's still racing. Please? Thank you. You stayed with Yukiko for a while and then walked her to the inn. Wonderful. Hey, it's evening. Let's go talk to Nana. Ko. There's a change in music. It's no longer upbeat here. It's sad music. For our empty home. Well, I guess we'll harvest the vegetables alone. Hey, Nanako, what do you think about the... Oh. Hey, wouldn't this be cool to have for din... Well, these ones seem to be implanted all right. Yes, we'll save. Hey, Nanako, stop watching that quiz show, it will rot your... Oh. Well, I guess we'll go to bed then. You really shouldn't bought anything from the home shopping program. And I never will again. You, you caused all the delivery drivers, caused Nanako to trust that other one. We can't ever buy anything. Also, we only have 269 uh, money. Wait, it's a Monday. Can we do anything on a Monday? No. Well, I'm gonna read a book. I'm gonna read Forever Macho. Yep. You begin reading Forever Macho. Every chapter begins. All men have the great spirit of masculinity within themselves. What is true manhood? The amazing Khan set out on a journey to find the Platonic ideal of masculinity. You feel more like a real man than ever before. 
and we finished reading it, our courage has significantly increased. We are heroic. Naoto, tomorrow, we shall talk to you. As a bold claim, I know. Right, let's save. Naoto, I'm ready. Let's chat. Uh, I'm sorry, although you got your knowledge and your uh, other one up here, you actually can't speak to Naoto yet because you also need to get your understanding to max. Uh, let's see. Naoto seems absorbed in thought about something. Seems that you need some sort of opportunity before you can become closer. Now you think about it, you do have a card the man in black gave you. Here's a card. What's this? He said I'd understand. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, excuse me, could you please accompany me for a brief period? I'd like to hear more about what transpired when you were given this card. Please, it won't take long. Okay. Samagawa Floodplain. I apologize. I wanted to talk someplace quiet. What kind of person gave this to you? Um, A man with black sunglasses is the best answer. Sunglasses? Mm. Wearing those in a town like this would only make one stick out. What we can take from that is that he wanted to hide his face at any cost. The man must also know you well. He wouldn't have entrusted the delivery to anyone he didn't know. But this is a small town, you could easily have looked up my address. I go to the trouble of giving the letter to you. Intriguing. Is he involved with this case, or another case altogether? If it's me he's after, he could be anyone. Oh, I'll keep the card. The man is most likely still here in Inaba. I cannot drag you further into this. I can't say that. That's such a Yosuke answer. I can't back out now. Huh? Uh, well, it's good to know that you're worried about me, but, uh... I apologize. I'm sorry. I seem to have a tin ear for other people's feelings. Yosuke-san told me so before. Yeah, sure he did. I'll look into this card and report my findings to you, so don't worry about me. As our leader, I know that you have a lot on your shoulders, so... Naoto seems to be worried about you. You have a completely different impression of Naoto than when you first met. You feel a faint bond forming between you and Naoto. I like how our first meeting's effectively like an interrogation, as in our first social link. It's good. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Fortune Arcana, which I believe was the last one we didn't have. Which is awesome. You have established the Naoto Shirigani social link of the Fortune Arcana. And we'll get XP. And she can wait down a knockdown uh, ally. While we are here, why don't we chat a little? Ah yes, there was something I wanted to ask you. Okay. Shall we go we home now? We talked about several aspects of the murders and went home. Wonderful. Evening. Well. It's evening time. Guess we'll just uh, save. Maybe we can make ourselves some food while we wait for Dojima to get back. You open the fridge. It looks the same as ever inside. Wait, that didn't say there was nothing we wanted to eat. That just said it looks the same as ever. Because nobody's buying any nice new things for us to eat for lunch. Alright. Well. Guess it's time for bed. Well, we can't read our courage books anymore. We're kind of done. Do we have any understanding books to read? Wait. It's our understanding that's not full? Uh, let's have a look here. I didn't... Re oh, I haven't read the uh, thing for this one. I was told that, so we will get there eventually. 
Understanding, yeah, or diligence. I think we can get diligence from making the model. Um, uh, I have knowledge and courage. I have understanding diligence though for Picross rules. Let's go. You begin reading Picross rules. Riddles submitted from children across the country are listed in this book. The gold medal winning riddle is... Question. What do you call the cutest girl in the world? Answer. Me. You become upset from the unsolvable and exceedingly stupid riddles in this book. This person says that they really liked Picross, the one who made this uh, thing here. But that's okay. It's Wednesday. No. Ayani, I'm not going to culture. Oh, it's Naoto. Oh, okay. Good day. Good afternoon. I'm not quite used to meeting you here. Do you have any plans after school? I'll decide later. Oh. You must already have plans. Next time then, if you will. Well, we also don't have any um, ability to get the persona. What's up? Yo. Hey, will you do anything after class is over? I want to hang out. Give us some thought, okay? Yeah, I'll give us some thought. I'm thinking. Okay. I wonder if Yukiko is free. It's Wednesday, which means that we can go to the hospital tonight, which is awesome. Um, although we don't get any courage. Like, we do get courage, but we don't get any, like, meaningful stat bonuses, I should say, for going to the hospital. So, think about it. Ooh. We just have a whole option set here. Hello. Uh, do we... Wait, it's not ready to advance. Okay, so we'll hold off there. I? Uh, did that just say your relationship will be closer soon? Yeah, okay, but I don't have the persona. I need an Andra for her. Okay. Let me have a little chat with Naoto. Um, let's see. So, Fortuna level 35, that's going to be expensive for 35, that's going to cost us, what, maybe 30,000? Hmm, we'll see who else is available. What did other people do today? Kanji, I, straight home. Marie, okay. Uh, we could spend time with I, I suppose we do get an upgrade, even if we don't have the persona. I think I do want to go to the hospital tonight, so at least we make 6,000 yen. It's about the first time I've ever gone there to get yen. But, uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's spend a day with I and then go and get some yen. I mean, we could also spend time with Naoto and increase Naoto's social... Let's go with Naoto, actually, because Naoto, uh, we probably have a, a few saved up because we've had multiple, um, like, support link-ups, whatever we're going to call it. Senpai. Oh, Alpex-san. I hope they allow Nanako-chan to have visitors soon. Of course, there's nothing we can do about that. Oh, if you don't mind, I'm free today. Yeah, let's spend the afternoon with Naoto. Yes. Naoto looks happy. Samagawa Floodplain. It seems Naoto has something to report about the card you gave her. As you can see, nothing is written on it. It's just a plain white card, but it does feel a bit stiff given its thinness. Without any indication of its contents, however, I'm, I have no idea who sent it. It's invisible ink. I'd chalk it up as a prank. That's no fun. <laughs> One would expect there to be more. Naoto is smiling like a child. Naoto's cell phone is ringing. Ah, excuse me. Yes, it's me. Ah, Yakushiji-san. What's the matter? A thief? In the Shiragani estate? Yes, yes, I see. I don't keep anything in that room that I'd miss terribly. You already have? 
Have you have already reported this to the police, I assume? Then I'll leave the rest to you. As long as Grandpa is safe, it doesn't matter. I can't take my eyes off of this case yet. Naoto hung up quickly. Uh. Um. What happened? Oh. Sorry, you heard, didn't you? Naoto looks a bit uncomfortable. That was from Yakushiji, my grandpa's secretary. It appears someone has broken into the Shirogani estate. My room was targeted, and he wanted to know if I could think of any particular item the thief might have been after. Several items pertaining to me were stolen from grandpa's inventory. I don't know about those, but my belongings aren't of any particular value, so... Who would want- oh, remember that card? Yes. That's precisely what I was thinking. Naoto nods. Regardless, you don't have to worry about me. We both have more pressing matters to attend to. I'm not sure how to react to you uh, worrying about me. Naoto seems exceptionally edgy. You feel you understand Naoto a bit more. I don't know, Naoto's nowhere near the most edgy thing in this game. Naoto's growth of heart has affected the persona as well. Invigorate! What is invigorate? Restores 3 SP. Oh, okay, so that's, um... Yeah, we've seen that before. Hmm. I'm looking at these, right? Hear me out. I think we get rid of Hamon and Mudon. If we need them, I can have them. I don't need my, um... Like, insta-kill is garbo against bosses, right, as far as we know, because it doesn't work. So therefore, like, if we need them, I can get them. So I'm just going to get rid of Mudon, because Hamon is a little bit more uh, more common. That's my logic. Right. And uh, we also get Mudo boost next level. <laughs> Love it. I'll see you Practically again. against her will, you walk Naoto to her house before going home. Okay. You can work as a janitor at the hospital today. Oh please, anything to get us out of this empty house. Now, I was told a secret, so don't tell anyone else. But apparently, there's something you can do with bugs. You can catch them at night. Look at that. Now, do we get different bugs? Who knows? But we get some bugs, and that's what matters. Okay, how many did he catch? That's the same, that's the same, that's the same, that's the same. We did get a jewel bug though. So if we need another guardian, we can potentially get it. Uh, we also have about a million rocks if we wanted to trade them into um, the person we can trade rocks into. Hello, what's up? My father-in-law walks around at night claiming to patrol the area. It's taking a toll on his health. I tried to convince him to go to the hospital, but he refuses. I'm so worried about him, especially after what happened to my mother-in-law. I'm to your mother-in-law. Is she the one that you abandoned in the Samagawa Riverbank? Oh, don't know where that little bit of, uh, you know, indignity came from. Apologies. Uh, let's... Item exchange? I was so confused, because I've never done this. Like, on purpose. Oh, these are XP only? I see, that's why they're absolutely garbage. Because you're meant to only equip them if you're grinding. So see, are there any that we can... So these ones here are actually good, if we can make them. Maybe. Like this one, seems pretty sweet, if we can make it, but we don't have any of the bits. Oh, we have some of these bits here. Some of them need you to have um, fishing, but if we had a look at this one... That's plus two to all stats. As, as, as a sick upgrade. Yeah, some of these are pretty good upgrades. This one, not as much, but you know. Some of them are okay. Although actually I did just see uh, the gun one's unlikely to be beaten with a plus five to all stats as the gun. But yeah, thought it was interesting to have a look. We could buy them, but like what if we need 
the uh, rocks for some other reason. Like, I don't know, what if the game says you need a thousand rocks to beat the final boss? Then what? Uh, oh, we can register? Yeah. Uh, and then by level, I haven't read this one. A monk who died while fasting, his spiritual power allows his body to continue to exist without rotting. I'm not sure if the uh, picture to the right really matches that, given that it's just bones, and I'm fairly... Bones don't really rot that well, do they? Anyway, it's said that he will appear before people on the Day of Salvation. I'm fairly certain that bones don't really rot. Maybe I'm wrong? I don't know. I mean, I guess the flesh isn't rotting because there's no flesh. Anyway. Uh, oh. No, because I want to check what that said, but I couldn't do it. Won't deepen just yet. We're going to the hospital anyway. We need 6,500 yen. How else are we going to get it? We clean the hospital room. Our courage would go up if we didn't have max courage. Okay. Good work. Yeah, this is the same thing as before. And then we get our 6,500 yen. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thursday! Hello, Naoto. Oh, it's Ayani. No, it's Naoto. Good, Good afternoon. I'm not quite used to meeting you here. Ah, yes, there haven't been any further developments regarding the card. I suspect it is mostly a prank in poor taste. I apologize for troubling with you with it. Naoto seems calm, but maybe you should walk her home after school. Okay. That's the only person? I don't feel unloved, but that's okay. We'll save. Let's go spend a day with Naoto. Why not? Seems good to me. We could spend a day with Yosuke. And that is very tempting, given how long... Has Yosuke just been sitting on three? I do feel bad, but like... Yosuke is a bad person. I don't want to spend a lot of time with Yosuke. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Um... Come to think of it, someone has sent Naoto a mysterious card. Maybe it'd be best if you walked her home. We're gonna become closer soon, let's go. Oh, no, no I'll be fine by myself gonna walk her home anyway. Um, well, if you don't mind. Naoto seems a bit relieved despite her protests. Okay. Good. This. This was in my shoe locker. Naoto is holding a sealed letter. A love letter? Hmm. That would be the standard rationale for a letter in one's shoe locker. Naoto is scowling. And judging by the name and the handwriting, the sender is a woman. She thoughtfully provided her year and class. When one factors in the heart-shaped seal as well, it's hard to imagine that this is related to my job in any way. In other words, there is no need to read it. <sighs> I apologize. I wasted your time with this pointlessness. How misleading. A sealed letter at a time like this. Um, You won't read it? Even if I read it, there's nothing I can do about it. Romantic entanglements are just that. Naoto is sighing. Whether the sender is male or female, I have no intention of responding. I have no time to be dilly-dallying with callow love affairs. I assume the same is true for you? Well, yeah, sure. It's this it's the same for me. Why why would you why would you even ask such a thing? Saying they love me without even knowing me. Ludicrous. Let's go. Senpai. Would you like to start somewhere on the way? Uh there are still some questions I have regarding the murders. Sure. Naoto was taking the case seriously. You feel your relationship with Naoto has grown deeper. Perfect. Also feels like you should have got that one before you had this month's thing, but that's okay. 
And uh, can I perform a follow-up attack? Awesome. Then, uh, shall we be off? Definitely. You talked with Naoto about the murders. I'll see you again. You walked Naoto to her house and went home. Well, back in the old house. Nanako's favourite cushion. Dojima's favourite newspaper. A letter with a weird atom thing in the bottom left. Probably a science report. A weird looking kettle at the top. Because it isn't used very often, often the kitchen is organised. There are ingredients in the refrigerator, you might be able to make lunch. Yeah, but... Then I'd need somebody to uh, buy the ingredients, and how are we going to do that? Right, well, off to the old, you know, grind, grindstone. We got to go and uh, do our job. It won't deepen just yet. That's all right. We're working at the hospital. We're not doing it for any kind of ulterior motive. We're doing it for the yen. Although we might buy a, a, a devil persona for the next one. Cool. I'll take my money, please. Feel your relationship is going to become closer soon? Oh, yeah. Friday. It's very much raining. Sometimes, while we're learning about history, we forget that history is still alive and with us today. The Wellwitchia is a plant in the, in the Nimbai Desert. Some individual specimens may be more than 2,000 years old. It must be very hardy, being able to survive cruel desert conditions for 20 centuries. And it's truly surprising that its two main leaves continue to grow for that entire time. I'm very curious about their overflowing will to live. Oh, were you listening, Alpex Coon? What desert is the Wellwitchia found in? Uh, it's the Nambi. Or uh, Namib. Good job, you got it right. I bet you're proud of yourself. The Wellwitchia is a really old plant living in the Namnib Desert. And, well, you'd know that, because you were there when the first ones were planted. I wonder if I'll gain some of its power for immortality if I manage to get one of my own. Oh, but don't tell any of the other female teachers that. I don't need the competition. <laughs> you gave the correct answer. Your knowledge has increased. It's after school. Well, nobody came to speak to us today, so I assume that Naoto does not have anything more in her case. Yeah, floor one. To skip straight here. Naoto is not around because it's raining and Naoto does not come out in the rain. Why? You know, mind your own business. I have no idea why Naoto doesn't go out in the rain. Is there anything that happens in the rain? Anybody got any ideas? Into TV, into TV, into TV. Went straight home. Movie with Reese. Why would you... Why did multiple people go to the movies with Reese? Maybe it's her month for the movies, but... Oh, I suppose it was. The last one was her. We just did it immediately. You know what we could do? If I have a look at our status here. We're very... We're almost there on understanding. I was thinking that we could try the Aya thing, but that's not really going to give us very much, and it will cost us most of our remaining cash. Hmm, so I don't really want to do that. What are we going to do with our time? We've got, like, just time. What do we even do with it? I mean, we could go fishing in the other beach. Like, we could fish here. I suppose? Yeah? I mean, we might as well do it once, and when it's raining, fishing is better, so why not try it once, you know? Oh yeah, this is what you should do when it's raining this hard. Go to the seaside. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Fish. 
I did tell he did tell me to finish expert fishing, but I'm not going to. There's a thunderstorm. What kind of fish would be here today? So we can get tuna, octopus, or octopus. Let's go for the middle one. We can get either with it. This is going to be difficult. Yeah, it's a little uh, odd, but we still got it. You caught bus stop sign instead of a fish. This may be useful as a weapon though. Excuse me? I caught a bus stop sign? <laughs> what? Okay, sure. And go. Go. Just drop. There we are. It's definitely flying off a little bit more, but that's okay. Well, we got the world's largest tuna. Let's go. Hey, I got a weapon from this. As far as I'm concerned, that's better than anything else we could have gotten. This cat is going to be the most well-fed cat the world has ever seen. Well... That'll be the octopus. Yeah, let's keep going. Why would you stop? Just go until we're out. I gotta say, the fishing minigame in this may suck a little bit. Like, it's not brilliant. It's about a thousand times better than the one that I was dealing with in Fire Emblem. Because it takes about ten seconds to do. And you consistently get what you want. Yeah. This is so much better. I'm trying to think, is there a fishing minigame I've ever liked? I spent a long time in the one in World of Warcraft at one point, fishing. I wouldn't necessarily say it was fun, but then now that I think back, I can't remember any of the game being fun. It was just something that had to be done. Hmm. I'm trying to think if there's any other fishing minigames that's ever been good. No, none, none are coming to mind. I don't know, what's your favourite fishing minigame? I don't know why I waited for a response. Like, yes. On this pre-recorded content, people are just going to say my favourite fishing minigame was actually in... X. But, you know, put it in the comments below. We got tuna. It's evening time. You could work as a janitor. Well, of course we could. And we don't even get music tonight. Just get silence. Small creaking of the house. Okay, well... Why would I... Yeah, that's the right one. I was going to say, why would I go to the shopping district? Because it's 100% the right one. Oh, I, I should buy a... Let's have a look at our social link here. For devil. We're rank 8. I'm definitely going to go buy the um, devil one. The reason I'm going to go buy it is because... Actually, you know what I should check first? Can I fuse it? I could fuse a Lilith. You know what? Let's fuse Lilith. Why not? I'm going to pass along Cool Breeze because that one seems neat. Growth 2. Uh... I don't know. Heavy Almighty damage, I guess, is a good one. And we're rank 8, so we get a bunch. We got one called Old One. Cool. Lilith. I'm Lilith. Just relax and leave everything to your big sis. Okay. Was Lilith not like... Lilith is in Genesis, I think. I can't remember anything more about Lilith. I'm going to be honest, I've not, it, it, it's a huge confession, I've not actually read the Bible, I've just basically know the cliff notes. I know, you're all shocked. You're, you're welcome to leave if this is a huge problem. Um, you know, come back, but you know, you could, you could leave for like 10 minutes. I give you my permission. 
Okay, we gained additional power. Various bonuses were granted. We got one magic and one luck. I mean, that's okay. We, we're probably never going to use Lilith. That's okay. Let's have a look. Um, check compendium. Lilith. Said to have been Adam's first wife. She refused to obey him, leaving Eden to become a demon of the night. All theories of her fall depict her as unfaithful. Seems like Lilith really is getting a pretty bad rap. You know. Basically, uh, it sounds like she wanted a divorce, and then just one person had all the PR. I guess Adam was the one in charge of writing all of the uh, stuff down and going, well, this is what happened. Well, of course, nobody wrote anything. You know what? Why am I even talking about this? Let's move on. Inaba Municipal Hospital, Empty Hospital Room. You busily clean the recently vacated hospital room. <gasps> you feel someone watching you. You decided to pretend not to notice and continue cleaning. Your courage has increased. Hey you, you can stop cleaning here. Who are you? Where's uh, Sayoko? We're going to be needing this room. So, can you get all your cleaning supplies out of here? Is there an emergency? Yuihara-san, one of the nurses, just collapsed. She needs to rest, but the doctors on break are using the lounge, so... She seems overworked. Uh, don't tell anyone I said that, okay? I'd rather not get hauled in for a review. Here, help me. A nurse laid Sayoko down on the bed and injected her with a syringe. In what? What? Okay. Uh. It sounded like she just needed a rest, but you've given her something to calm her down? Seems a little unethical. She didn't have to do that. I was just a little wobbly. It's important to rest. And what if there's no time to rest? There's always work waiting for me. Ah, uh, I'm lucky they didn't tie me down with an IV. Uh, I'm alright now. I'll be going. Seems Sayoko is still set on continuing to work. What should you do? Physician, heal thyself! Uh, no. What are you going to tell them don't do it all by yourself? What? Why are you acting so high and mighty? Ah. Oh. I mean... I might be able to save someone's life. I need to do what I can. I can't spend time worrying about myself. Otherwise, I'd never be able to face him again. You're just running away. You think I'm hiding from my problem? No, I looked right into the situation and decided to do what I can. Right into it. Uh... Oh, I see I... I was doing it for myself. I wanted to escape the pain. I was working hard to avoid feeling anything at all. I see that now. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Sayoko seems to be holding back tears. I get it. Yeah, I get it. Thank you. Sayoko tries to smile. You feel that you were able to give Sayoko some support. Rank 9. Awesome. I'm going to rest for a little while longer. You can go now. Don't look at me. You left Sayoko and went home. You earned 6,500 from your work as a janitor. Yeah, but we cl we didn't clean anything, no. We, we just, like, you know, wiped the table and then sat on a chair. Okay, well... I think now is the time to end the episode. Thank you for watching! I'll see you next time.
Goodbye.